Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It is Wednesday and we have a magic at your door box. We have our November box. Super excited to see what is inside. I actually got this a couple of days ago. I've just been waiting so that I can sit down with you guys, open it, see what's inside together. And I'm gonna try to do this a little bit quickly today just because it's already like a little afternoon and we are losing light outside. It's gonna get dark in the next like hour or so and it's kind of snowy here so uh, yeah, don't have a whole lot of light to work with. So let's go ahead and not waste any time and let's see what is inside. I will say the box feels really light this month compared to normal, so I am definitely curious. All right. Maybe not. <laughs> it does not want to open. Here we go. So first opening it. Oh. We have our little November flyer and price guide as always. So I'm gonna just set that aside. And there's a lot of packing materials in this that I can't even see anything peeking through. It is completely covered. Oh, I do notice a little something peeking out on the side. So I'm gonna grab that first. Oh, that is so pretty. So this is an aerial little postcard. It is from the Wonderground Gallery. So I don't actually use these as postcards, but I do keep them as kind of art prints and sometimes I'll like hang them up or put them on like my pin boards and things just as some decoration. So I have actually never seen this one and that is really, really cool. Carefully digging through, the cats are on standby. Oh, interesting. Okay. We have a little Jasmine doll. So here is this. It looks like her hair is made out of yarn. And not entirely sure what we will do with this. Maybe trade it or sell it or gift it to someone. Just because I don't really do a whole lot of like plushes and stuff. But... She's pretty heavy. Um, yeah, we just live in a small like apartment. It's like under a thousand square feet, so we don't really do a whole lot of like stuffed animals just because they do take up a lot of room other than like our little like Ufufis and Zooms. Those are tiny and manageable and stuff, but not really a big stuffed animal person. Oh, thought she made a sound at first. Otherwise, so we'll probably be putting her up for trade or gifting her to somebody. I see a pair of ears. Always a good day when you get ears in your box. So this is like their hollow pair. This actually was released in the park. Um, I think like right after I left this summer and I was super bummed because I really wanted them. I am so excited for the next Mickey Memories that's going to be released in like two weeks now because he is all like hollow and super extra and I love it. So definitely love these ears and I mean they're kind of white and snowy looking so perfect for winter. I will probably wear these next month so uh, this is awesome I'm really happy about these i see the little silver pouch i will set this aside for right now just kidding that is actually everything that's in the box so i will grab the silver pouch and we'll see what's in that okay it feels like two items are inside Seems like we have another pin lanyard. So we have a Disney princess one. It's got all of the princesses down here. It does open and close. All right, definitely gonna have to go in and like update my preferences cause I do not need like a fourth lanyard. I don't really, like I said, use them cause we don't yet live near the park. So we don't like go a whole lot and do like this kind of pin trading. We more so just buy pins and keep them in like our collector's books and stuff like that. Um, so this I will probably be parting with just because I don't really 
have a use for it right now. And I feel like I pretty much only need one pin trading lanyard and I bought the one I want, which was the cats and dogs one. Otherwise, I think most of them aren't like the greatest looking personally, but just my opinion. And then our last item, it feels like a little jewelry box, so fingers crossed. Oh, it is! Very cute little Mickey packaging, if you can see that. We will see what is inside. It has a fact number on the bottom. And, oh, that's so cute! It is a pair of Mickey stud earrings. So I will totally wear these all the time. They are sterling silver, so perfect if you have like really sensitive skin like I do. These are amazing. Let me show you them up close just because they are super tiny little studs. So here they are, just little Mickeys with some gemstones in them. I think that these are adorable. Again, we'll totally rock these all the time. All right, so totally love these two items. Super excited about this. Looking at them from like an actual retail standpoint, they do basically make up what I paid for the box, so that's awesome. Really glad to have these. The postcard for Ariel is also super nice. It's more just like the jasmine and the lanyard that were definite like kind of misses for me, don't really need them. They seem a little more like they're for like little kids or something, but I will definitely be having a look at my preferences. I know when everything got kind of updated to the automated system, it used to be you just kind of like send them an email with stuff that you like. So I'll need to look over and make sure I didn't like accidentally check a few things because I know I did that pretty quickly on my phone. <laughs> and yeah, that is everything for my Magic at Your Door box. If you are interested in signing up for your own box, definitely check out all of the information in my description down below. They are an awesome company and they're actually local to me in Chicago here, so really fun to get to support them and see them grow. I also got my Tokyo Kawaii Club mailer as well yesterday, so I'm going to be opening that probably on Friday for you guys, right before Vlogmas is about to start. Really excited for Vlogmas. Let me know if you guys want like more like sit down, like this kind of video like I usually do, or like actual vlogs mixed in as well. Like, let me know what you guys are interested in seeing. Super excited as this will be my first year participating and I absolutely love Christmas and I have a ton of really fun like Christmas, like Disney decor and stuff that we'll be putting up around the apartment. So excited to kind of take you guys along with me for some of that. Let me know what your favorite item was down below, or if you subscribe to this box, let me know. I will go and watch for myself if you posted a video and see what you got in yours. All right, guys, make sure to give this video a big thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. I will see you then on Friday for my Tokyo Kawaii Club opening. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Bye!